Good evening, everyone. I hope you're doing well tonight. Staying safe and healthy as it's a very rainy, cold night here at the Toy Guy's office, I can tell you that. So, we're going to go ahead and do a quick review here of Transformers Siege War for Cybertron Trilogy Autobot Hound. Hound, as you know, is a definite G1 favorite, uh, not just of mine, but I think everyone who is a Transformers fan, we all love Autobot Hound. And I can't say enough good about the, the, the uh, War for Cybertron Siege and Earthrise and Kingdom toy lines. They are all great. Uh, just amazing. Uh, the Autobots and the Septicon. The, the, the toys they're putting out, to me, are modernized um, G1 toys. And, you know, we've needed that. We have needed that for a long... I know that they have the Masterpiece Collection or whatever that is. And there's a few... Uh, there's a lot of knockoffs out there that uh, that really do uh, do a good job replicating, you know, our love of the G1. But... Uh, or I have a love from G1. That's... I mean, I'm an 80s kid. Well, I'm still a big kid. But uh, when I was a kid in the 80s, it was Transformers. Had my attention pretty much all the time. So, uh, I'm going to go ahead... Got the old exacto knife out here. <clears throat> We're going to cut, cut this package open very carefully, so I don't cut my arm off or anything. And uh, kids at home, if you want to, if you want to try to save your package and not destroy it, let your parents open it for you. That would be the uh, that's the best advice I can give anybody. Let your mom and dad open that for you. That way you don't destroy it. And uh, I very carefully always. Um, whether I'm going to keep it or not, because I mean, I may put it on my bookshelf, but a lot of this stuff I just give away to people. Um, I've met a lot of friends now here on uh, on Instagram and Facebook, and so uh, you know, if it's something that I'm not into and I'm I'm reviewing it, then I either give it to them or we're going to do some more contests. I got that contest going on right now. If you like and subscribe, please do. I'll you'll be entered into the. Uh, the uh, Transformers War for Cybertron Netflix Optimus Prime. Still sealed in his box. I haven't even opened him. And uh, I need to get one, though, to review. So we're going to go ahead and, I guess, uh, since I rambled the whole time instead of uh, cutting, uh, cutting to a break, uh, we'll just go ahead and get this bad boy done here. Uh, got the turntable over there. That thing I find kind of annoying. And you know what? If it annoys you all, too, I am sincerely sorry. I thought it would be kind of cool to... To kind of, whoops, excuse me, my big fat hand there in the way. I just thought it would be kind of cool to to have, I guess. I don't know why the hell I even ordered it for, but I did. And um, be very careful when doing this. You don't want to, you don't want to, first off, you don't want to hurt yourself. And that can be easily done. But you don't want to damage the... Uh, the action figure, as my little guy says, calls them little, they're action figures. So, um, let's pull Hound out. Oh, he just came right out of there. Thank, man, he was easy. Real easy. Easier than my ex. Oops, sorry, I shouldn't have said that. And, uh, let's see here. All right, there we go. Well, I don't know what the hell this up here is, but we're going to go ahead and we're going to cut that out of there too. Oops, there it is. Cut that out of there, and uh, why the hell would they bother to even? Why would you even bother to, to 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 put a little band around that piece for, or the other one that just fell out? Why would why would they bother? Anyway, all right. So, okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Can't find the. Uh, there it is. Always got to be safe. All right. You could easily get very hurt with that uh, with that piece so Autobot Hound here we go uh, I've not I got a lot more stuff here to do tonight so I'm not going to transform him um, he is he got uh, we'll talk about articulate let's look at these oh, sorry I gotta put these other pieces here um, maybe the instructions would really be helpful too uh, that should go right here I want to take a quick break and I'll be right back. I don't want to. All right, be right back. Okay, everyone, and we're back here. Finally got that figured out. wasn't too bad. Just wasn't uh, applying myself well to it. I don't guess. <laughs> so anyway, here we go. Uh, Autobot Hound. He's very comparable to the size of Wheeljack. 
um, from the Netflix series that was released. Uh, you know, we're not going to train. I'm not going to go down that hole. I got a lot more of these to do tonight, so I'm not going to go down that whole rabbit hole transforming each one. As far as articulation goes, though, Hound has full articu great articulation in the arms. Go, they go all the way out, shoulder up. There's a full three. There's a, whoops, yes, got movement here in the hands as well. His uh, gun goes. There's a gun that goes here, and one that goes here. And, and when you transform him, they actually go together. And this here goes to the back of this. So um, remember that. And uh, legs. Whoops. Let's move these arms out of the way first. Okay, legs. That's for transforming, but. Legs, great that way. He could definitely do a full Jackie Chan. Head, yes, head does move, but it's a pretty tight, pretty tight to get in there to, to kind of move him around. And all right. There we go. Autobot Hound. I wish I had. To, I don't have any, any here at the moment that I can compare him to. Just yeah, I don't have anything here yet. I can compare him with height and size, but he is. He definitely appears to be the same size as uh, Blue Streak here, and, or Smoke Screen, sorry, and uh, Jazz and the rest of them. And uh, for uh, well, Jazz is for the Studio Eighty Six line, but he's definitely comparable to Sideswipe, Red Alert, and. Uh, Wheeljack uh, of the same line. So there you have it. Transformers, Earthrise, War for Cybertron Trilogy, Autobot Hound. And that's going to do it for this guy. Uh, highly recommend him. Solid 10. Just like the rest of these in my opinion. You know, you may... You, whoops. Uh, forgot to say that yes, he does have... The, there is movement in his feet. His feet does move. Very little. But it is there. So... There you have it. All right, everyone. Uh, we'll talk to you again here soon. I got grapple and smoke screen left to come up tonight. So thanks a lot. Let's talk to you soon. Please subscribe to my channel. I'd really appreciate that. And uh, yep. All right. That's enough. <laughs>